special guest for you tonight. Oh, yeah. Who are you? Yes. It's your boy, NF Jizzle for Shizzle, making this is all like, yeah. <laughs> it's Nathan in the place to be, man. Oh, I'm chilling. It's going to be a good look. Yeah. Oh, let's do what we do. Yeah, yeah, we got Nathan for the first hour of the show. Yeah. We got exclusives. Busy, man. Busy, man. Oh, it's nuts, you know. You're going to, as I said, I told you before. At time. Yeah, like you didn't know, people. Meadow's track of the week. We got satin. A little satin satin for you, as we do. Track of the week's a big one, as per usual. Yeah, it's a little bit different, you know, actually. Normally we're going on to the, you know, hip-hop, R&B, you know, R&G show, you know, that's how we do. But this time, well, Nathan, you were down last night for the ACS ball, obviously. Yeah, it was a good look. Yeah, There's right. a lot of good-looking ladies down there. I have to say, big up <laughs> everyone that was down there yesterday. It was a good look. But he's being a gentleman and just saying, nah, they weren't nah, I'm just saying, yeah, 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 I had to judge a competition. There was girls, you know, that must be hard, modeling man. and dancing and stuff. I just, you know, it's, it's crazy. <laughs> so, in light of that, we have got a. Re- ah, it's not even dance or it's just dance your backside off. Go crazy for this one. This one is so big. You better listen to it in the cars. You better listen to it on radio. That's We're nuts. playing it. It's a big track. Just remember, it is our Nando's track of the week coming up in about 10 minutes' time. We're going to be giving away those Nando's meal vouchers. You know how we do. We give you the best food. We give you the best urban music. Yeah. Honestly, honestly, <laughs> honestly, you lot need to just drop that on me still. I'm a big fan of Nando's, innit? So, <laughs> you know, obviously. No, I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what, you don't like Nando's? No, I do like Nando's. Oh, okay, Nando's okay. is like the only thing that you eat when you're on the road. Do you <laughs> don't you understand? That's road food. You, know, you understand I'll what say, I'm saying? I was saying this the other day. Like, when, we first, when we first got the sponsor, I was saying... Oh yeah, KFC, you know, it's the old the old time one, you know. Yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. the old the old one. Nando's. Nando's, is the Nando's, new, Nando's. That's the new lick. Like, <laughs> that's exactly what it is. It's the new lick. Yeah. yeah if yeah. you don't know about Nando's, you're slipping, cuz. You get me? <laughs> you're slipping. You get me? Yeah, you heard it here first. And if Jizzle says it, yeah. Nando's, that's what you need in your life. Yeah, okay, man. that's coming up in ten minutes. Right now it's the Nando's track of the week. It's Movado featuring Jay-Z. Big and choice. this is called On the Rock. Chisel sitting in front of us right now. <laughs> yeah. Now we got to also add one thing. Mm-hmm. Since you left Big Brother, yeah. Since you've been to the states, yeah. Doing big, big things that you're going to talk about in a minute. Uh huh. This is your first UK interview. This is my first UK interview since for a hot minute. Let's just <laughs> say that because I've basically just been studio hibernating since I came out of Big Brother. Um, I just started to work on the album, done some work over here. Um. No going out. I've been mad boring. So <laughs> when you guys see me out, if I go out every once in a while, can you show me some love, please? What's going on? The, I'm, t- I'm talking to the ladies especially because obviously i kind of been hibernating and then, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but, that's, but that's what it takes to be on top, man. That's Most what you got to do. you got to up your work rate. Yeah, no, no, definitely. I've been coming back now. I see how much I've really, really been missing out on everything. Just going studio. Do you know what I mean? And it's, it's a lot, but... It's worth it, man. I have just been doing my work, and that's the only thing that matters to me. Do you know what I'm saying? It's just been it's just been very good. Then I'm creating some good stuff. Well, okay. We we spoke to you briefly on the phone after you came out of Big Brother House. Yeah, yeah. So let's just talk about that for a hot minute. Yeah, let's do that. How did the, how has that affected you and that, that whole thing? How has that affected your not your career, but just you afterwards? What's that done for you? All right, not even career wise. It just it made me even more grinding. Like if you understand what I'm saying. I had yeah, a lot of time. Grind. Yeah, I know. I know, Mr. Grind himself. <laughs> I like. It was crazy being in there. I had a lot of time to think about my next moves and then how much I want to put into my next moves. Do you know what I'm saying? And since then, that's all it's been. Because I feel like that whole experience was for a reason. And I haven't fulfilled that the second part to being on Big Brother. And that's what I've been working. That's what I've been working towards. You know what I mean? Like, that, it was all for a reason. So I have to capitalize on me being on TV for, like, you know, how much. Loads of new different people. Loads of opportunities that have come up because of it as well. People that say... Like, we're waiting for your next stuff so we can back you, basically. Yeah. Do you know what I'm saying? So I just got to make sure that my stuff's on point. Yeah, man, definitely. So did, did you actually get time to, like, relax in the house? Or did you, were you constantly thinking, damn, what am I going to do next? i got to come back big, you know? Well, there was it was both. Whoever saw me um, know that I was spending a lot of time in the hot tub. <laughs> because it was... <laughs> Out of way from everything yeah, else. Because it was trouble. a lot of time. it was a lot of time to think and just get my thoughts together. Yeah. And... 
chill. A lot of you time. It was a lot of me time, and it was it was the most like a holiday I've had in like five years. Anyway, <laughs> so anyway, it, going to the states every other month. Nah, for real, because it's all work. Else. When that was the time, that was the time to just think about work and not actually do any work. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, like every other time, I'm going to Japan is or um anywhere, even if it's Jamaica, I go back home to Jamaica. Um, I still end up working. Do you know what I mean? Which is always fun for me. It's never it's never like it's not a holiday. It's it's always fun for me. But um that was really time for me to think and since I've been out, it's just been back to work, back on that grind. So have you had any time, you know, to talk to anyone anyone in the house that you got on with particularly well, like maybe Latoya, yeah. Not Latoya, saying. that's all I'm saying. <laughs> 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 what? <laughs> Say what? <laughs> no, nah, no, nah, no. Nah, me and Latoya are cool. I haven't spoken to her for a minute though, but it's because I've been away. I've been, I've, I've just been doing my thing. So I apologise. In fact, I'm gonna call her because she texted me the other day. So I'm gonna call her. But we've been speaking to, um, you know, Jeremy's my boy. I'm gonna meet up with him um hey, tomorrow. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I've been talking to um people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so just tell us, just slide over the fact we've been doing in the states. <laughs> Now nah, you know what, yeah, because I made a promise to you, lot. I'm gonna be. I'm, I told you when I come back, I'm giving you the exclusive, right? And then I came back just last weekend, and what my I'm giving you lot the exclusive yeah, in it, so yeah, you can't yeah, say. Yeah, yeah. That is worth. That is worth. All right, well, a um, couple of things have happened. Um, just been working on a new album. Just signed. Um, management with Violator Records That's people that manage um, Buster Rhymes, oh. Missy Elliott, 50 Cent And then there's a um, collaboration Coming up with Buster Rhymes Don't tell no one I told you Don't tell no one I told you No I'm playing Apart from all of the millions of people that's listening um, And um, When I go back I'm going to be working with LOS Who is the um, producer of Dream um, Purple Kisses that we just heard yeah. And Bed and all of that stuff And yeah. Shorty's a 10 um, But there's, there's, there's a lot of stuff going on the new stuff that I've been working on is, it's been a good look you know what I'm saying so you know it's, it's been good for me it's been productive ok talking to Buster Rhymes Buster Bus. yo I was this song the reason why I wanted to play this is because I was there when he was recording this oh <laughs> and, and we was there about, it was sick it was sick ok this is Buster Rhymes Talisa light skin guy F.A. take it easy face Mother's Frales and Dubs Dynamite Kill Nana Nai ha ha you're listening to the RNG show the number one urban show in the south so sad ha ha Nana Nai yeah Yes! <laughs> hey. Yeah, that's Talisa. <laughs> shut yeah. up, shut up. <laughs> I, I need to talk to Talisa. I haven't spoken to her for a minute. That's my girl, man. She's heavy. We're waiting on the new tune, man. Yeah. N-dubs, N-dubs, whenever they come out, yeah, they come with fire. Yeah, man. I rate N-dubs, and no one can't tell me nothing. I'll yeah. fight you for N-dubs. <laughs> I will. I will. 